morning, Springton Lake. I'm Yasmin. And I'm Kenzie Cabrales with your morning announcements. Today is November 3rd. Today is a day 7-6. Please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Today is a day 7-6. Please listen carefully to some changes, the whole group rehearsals for today. For sixth grade, band and chorus, chorus students will attend a whole group rehearsal for both periods. Orchestra students should attend their six, day six specials. Seventh and eighth grade band students will attend their whole group rehearsals for both periods. Orchestra and chorus students should attend their day six specials. The next Pride Club meeting will be Wednesday, November 8th after school in the library. See you there. Do you have a lot of leftover Halloween candy? NJHS will be collecting wrapped candy from now until November 1st, 15th in Mrs. Ava's room, A105. All donations benefit a local food pantry. Bonjour Spartans, in honor of National French Week, please wear something French on Monday. Here is a clip of a famous French speaker you may have already known, brought to you by the French Club. Bonjour Springton Lake, this is Madame Howe collaborating with Donovan Williams for National French Week. Did you know Serena Williams speaks French? Serena Jamika Williams was born on September 26, 1981, and she's an American professional tennis player. She is widely regarded as one of the greatest tennis players of all time. She once said, I wanted to win the French Open and wanted to speak French when I won. Merci Springton Lake et bonne journée. The library is taking a poll of favorite books for a special Thanksgiving politician board. Please look at the Google form titled Books Giving in your Schoology Lunch Course and answer the questions. Let's check in with Dr. Sal for the answer of Trivia Tuesday, Wordle Wednesday, and the Friday Funny. Hey Spartans, it's Dr. Sal coming your way today. Happy Friday. I hope that you're doing well. I hope that you've had a great week and that you are ready for the weekend. It's hard to believe, but it is November. November is here. We have flipped the calendars. And hey, we only have one week to go in the first marking period. So today, we're gonna to be following a special schedule to allow you a little bit of extra time if you need to catch up, if you need to finish a project, or if you need to see a teacher for extra help. So that special schedule after sixth period today, you're gonna go back to your first period class. That's gonna be your home base. You're gonna check e-hall pass to see if you have any appointment passes that your teachers have set up. Uh, if you need to see someone and you don't have an appointment pass, Talk to them this morning, get that set up in e-hall pass. Main goal for this afternoon, use the time wisely. Check hack. Know what you're going to be working on. Come in with a plan, accomplish that plan, and get things situated so that you finish out the marking period on a strong note that you feel good about your grades and your report card. Remember, just one week to go. And next week, it's a short week. So on Monday, we have an early dismissal. You're going to be dismissed at 1130. It will be another special schedule. We'll be following kind of abbreviated class periods, similar to what we did a few weeks ago when we had an early dismissal. And then there's no school for you on Tuesday. It's election day. So it's a short stretch between now and the end of the marking period. So again, use your time wisely. Next week also kicks off our canned food drive being sponsored by the Community Service Club. It's being done in conjunction with this year's turkey trot that I know that you've heard about in the morning announcements. So get those cans, bring them in. The homeroom with the most cans will be winning a prize on the day before Thanksgiving break. So you're helping out a great cause and your homeroom may win a prize. So this morning, I'd like to take a moment to congratulate our November Spartan Students of the Month. These students have been selected by their teachers for consistently demonstrating the four R's here at Springton Lake. Students, if I call your name at the end of the announcements today, if you would please make your way down to the main lobby so that we can take your photograph. Congratulations go out to Lillian Wolf, 
Ian McFarlane, Milo Ward, Nora Duffner, Austin Kleiber, Molly Petka, Lincoln Cleary, Maddie Luber Solik, Claire Scanlon, Ryan Serzan, Daphne Lackus, Aiden Lai, Jack Jancic, Kayla Schaefer, Reese Pettit, Evan Quinn, Chase Callahan, and Brooke Osga Cass. So congratulations to all of our November Spartan Students of the Month. Now, because it's Friday, we're wrapping up lots of things today. So first of all, the answer to our Trivia Tuesday question, I asked you which of the four individuals had the most Instagram followers. Well, the correct answer is Ronaldo. He has 609 million followers. Wow, incredible. So congratulations to Despreet Singh, Brendan McDonald, Cora Fry, Lily Din, Matthew Actert, Kunj Patel, Daniel Morris, Antonoli Poggio, Hugh McCaffrey, and David George. You submitted correct answers, and you were randomly selected to receive some bonus Spartan Bucks. And our answer to our Wordle Wednesday, it was a tricky one, but the answer was empty. So congratulations to the following students that were uh, selected for submitting a correct answer. Andrew Reno, Sinyuan Liang, Jacob Herbert, Sullivan Gosley, Cole McEwen, Shane Tillman, Claire Scanlon, Tristan Wright, Darcy Pippen, and Maximus Villalobos. Way to go. Bonus Spartan Bucks have been added to your live school accounts. And finally today, because it is Friday, it is time for everyone's favorite Spartan Scoop segment, the Friday Funny. So let's see, what do I have for you today? So what's the opposite of irony? Well, that would be wrinkly. <laughs> so my kids have already started planning next summer's family vacation, and they recently put together a complete PowerPoint presentation explaining why we should travel to the world's largest water park. Yeah, it has several slides. So, you know, it was Halloween this week, and my wife and I were having dinner on, on Halloween, and she asked me, so who is your favorite vampire? And I quickly said, oh, that Muppet from Sesame Street. And she said, oh, he doesn't count. And I said, I assure you, he does. All right, Spartans, I hope that you have a great Friday. I hope that you have a great weekend. And remember, use today's time wisely. It is a gift of time. Get those grades ready for the end of the first marking period. Take care, Spartans. That's all of our announcements for today. Have a great day, Spartans.